The old adage says, don't put the horse in front of the cart. The cart is where you put what is valuable, what you want to protect, what you need to uh, put emphasis on. But it's the horse that's the driving force behind the whole process of pulling the cart and bringing it to where you want to bring. For decade after decade, baseball coaches have been putting the emphasis on hitting and swing mechanics. I know they are important, but it's not the horse that's going to get it done for a baseball player. For hitting, the horse is the timing of the body, getting yourself in sync. As we watch this player in the orange jersey, this is an example of being out of sync. The player recognizes that he should be taking the pitch to the opposite field. But very, very subtly, if you watch the momentum of his bat and watch the placement of his, his legs and watch where he gathers his adrenaline, if you watch carefully, you can see that his own body is out of sync with itself. I don't even need to see what the picture is on this picture. Because I could tell the, this hitter is out of sync with himself. The main idea I want to relay to you is timing to a hitter is about timing the adrenaline. The horse behind all athletics is to time the adrenaline. Whether you're hitting someone on the football field, getting prepared to, to smack a tennis ball, whatever. It's about timing your body's adrenaline. We have been conditioning coaches and players for generations to worry about swim mechanics. And swim mechanics can be perfect, but if the adrenaline is not there, if it's not in sync, then the cart is going before the horse because the horse to hitting is timing the adrenaline. Now for a lot of coaches who are going to try to figure this out on themselves, God bless you because it's, it's very difficult. And I've been blessed to have learned the intricate layers behind the adrenaline and what goes into every hitting model. There's about 10 hitting models players hit from. And the key is to learn how to time the adrenaline according to that hitting model. I have developed a very sophisticated formula that teaches coaches and players how to understand the layers of the adrenaline better and how to not just understand it, but how to time it according to their athletic DNA and better according to their hitting pattern, what model they're trying to follow and incorporate as they stand at home plate. There is no more guessing about this anymore and wondering. I have definitively defined the placement of where each hitter should collect and gather their adrenaline. So when I tell you the nuts and bolts to hitting, the driving force, the horse that's going to pull the cart to hitting is timing, believe me, it is. And it is for everything we do in athletics. We are timing our adrenaline. Coaches, I have reasoned this out that the only players who understand timing and benefit from our instruction for mechanics are the ones who just get it. They have a knack for timing. They accidentally sometimes just fall into it. Or some players are just born with the understanding of what they're trying to do with their bodies and time that adrenaline. An example of seeing where timing is in action is looking on the on deck circle. After you watch a player warm up with his bat weight and he stretches himself out and then he takes a couple practice swings, watch what happens right before he goes to home plate. Most hitters will stand there and they start to get their bodies in sync with the pitcher's delivery. 
and they don't even swing the bat. So why is that? Why did it, why didn't the hitters just swing? Well, because they understand the most important places, getting themselves locked in to the pitch that's just about to be delivered. It's timing, but deeper than that, it's timing the adrenaline. When you want to help a hitter improve himself for the game, and remember you're a player and you want to improve yourself for the game, it all begins with timing. Sure, mechanics are important uh, at the last realm where you're going to put the bat to the ball, but it all comes back to the main ingredient is timing your adrenaline. I have the 10 hitting models for timing that's already on my website. I have the six absolutes for timing that is soon be coming out. Dave Kirloff, Language of Hitting.